Hello, my name is Hannah Hogan, and I was an actress in To Each Her Own film. Tell us a little bit about the film. Um, yes, it's a, it's a coming out story. I play a character so named Jess, who's married um, and falls in love with a woman uh, named Casey, and she's dealing with the dilemma of how to come out to herself and to the world and of course to her husband um, while she's falling in love with Casey and uh, you know to top it all off she ends up becoming pregnant uh, and so she feels like she can't be with Casey because now there's this extra detail, huge detail of being pregnant. Um, so it just follows the drama of um, what it's like uh, to dealing with your own truths and uh, how to come out to, you, to yourself and to your, to your spouse if that's how it is and uh, yeah. <laughs> um, so, this is the world premiere, right? It is. Do you want? To, yeah. Are you? Do you want to talk about any kind of uh, excited about the premiere that's being here in oh, Fresno? Yeah. yeah, it's it's super exciting. I mean, we've been getting star treatment. Um, I I like I'm just a broke actor in Toronto. This is something we did two years ago, um, and so it's just fabulous. We've got flown down here, we're staring, staying in the Marriott, uh, sleeping in a big, nice, comfortable bed. Everyone at this festival is absolutely wonderful. We had a great time last night at the opening uh, party, and yeah, it's fabulous. I've never experienced anything like this before. Um, excitement, fear, nervousness, but mostly just like excitement is, is, is what I'm feeling right now, for sure, yeah. So your film's, uh, your film's screening tonight. Mm -hmm. um, and then uh, you're planning on staying in Fresno a little bit after, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, let me just get you focused a little better here. All right. Let's um, let's talk about how it's been so far since you've been in town. What have you done? Um, like the parties, the things like that. There's only been one party I know, but let's at least talk about that. Yeah. Uh, well, we flew in yesterday. Um, Heather and myself flew into Los Angeles, and Trey flew into uh, San Fran because she's leaving earlier. Uh, and then I guess we all met up around like four or five and um, just like had a couple drinks and like moseyed our way down here. We got really lost last night uh, trying to find the place. Uh, but then once we did, it was just like really super cool. Um, it's, it's really nice like walking up to the theater because it's like the bright lights and it, it's kind of like this classic like old theater feel. So it's really cool. And uh, yeah, from like the minute we walked in to the minute we left, it was just good times. Um, great party, great food. Uh, free drinks, like it's been great. Like no complaints at all. <laughs> um, I guess lastly, or two, a couple more things. Um, is there anything about the, the film or the making of the film? Anything funny? Any any stories that might be interesting? Oh shit! Too many. Can't even go into those details. Um, yeah, uh, it was great. I've I've never done a feature length film before. Um, so as an actor approaching it, it was it was huge. It was just so much to sort of work on and, and take on, um, but it was ultimately really rewarding, especially when we saw the final product um, a couple of years later, and it, it's, it was just so great. Um, met a lot of really wonderful people, uh, learned a lot about myself um, and about the gay community while I was shooting it, which was wonderful. Um, yeah, it's just, it was great, and it just continues to, to be great, and it's just wonderful to be here, so, yeah. Um. Could you talk a little bit about your um, co-stars and director? Yeah, um, I auditioned for this uh, through my casting director, or through my through my my creative director at my college. Like in between first and second year, uh, Heather sent out casting calls like through Toronto, and so I met Ke uh, Heather at the uh, casting call, and we hit it off immediately. Uh, we got along really well. She's really funny, very very passionate, which I could totally relate to because um, I'm a very passionate actress and uh, so that's great we always had a really great uh, relationship I spent a lot of time with her uh, in Barrie basically shooting like five days a week for about five months so it was, it was pretty cool um, met Tracy about the same time uh, really cool girl like wise beyond her years like I'm a little bit older than her but she's one of those people that are just like so wise and like really fun, uh, very open-minded, and um, it was just it was a pleasure to work with both of them. 
And um, lastly, I guess, uh, can you tell me your impressions so far of uh, Fresno and the festival itself? I mean, Fresno, I mean, kind of preface this by saying it's definitely, um, as far as California goes, it's the Bible Belt yeah. of California, you know? Yeah. So this festival being here is um, out of the ordinary, but it's a pretty large festival just uh, despite all of that. Yeah. So um, I'm trying to get people's impressions of their experience since they've been here. It, it feels like a really big deal, um, uh, being like a complete foreigner to this area and to this side of the, the continent. I've never been to the West Coast before. Um, it's great. I saw some stuff on the local news when I was watching TV in my hotel. Um, yeah, it, there's a lot of buzz about it. The theater was packed last night, the opening night. Um, the party was really big. Uh, it, it doesn't feel like it's part of the Bible Belt. Some, um, Stefan mentioned it to me earlier, but it, not at all. Like everyone just seems really cool, uh, really liberal. Um, you know, I'm from Toronto, so I'm, I'm pretty used to like being surrounded by really open-minded people, um, and that's definitely how I feel now. So yeah, it's awesome. Anything else you want to add? Uh, yeah, thanks so much for having us. This is a huge honor. Uh, I'm so proud of, of Heather, the director, and Tracy, and myself, and all the hard work that we put into it. So thank you so much, Fresno, for having us down here. It's a great honor.